What is going on guys, Zach here, and welcome to another video. Today we have Wave 2, another old game of mine. I recently did Wave 1 as an old game, and I'll put the link in the description to see that. So this is Wave 2. I actually, the backing behind Wave 2 was a competition that I had with Jade Inc. at the time, where it was a wave-based survival game. And uh, so he made a game called J Fighter, and I made Wave, Wave 2. Alright, uh, I never actually released the game though, so technically he won, uh, I just didn't, I didn't have a couple things in it that I would like to have had, but I probably should have still released it. Um, so, without further ado, let's play the game. Right off the bat, I just started up the game here, and it says, Warning, Wave 2 contains high flashing colors and motions. Click Agree to continue. I don't know what I'm agreeing to, um, but if any of you are sensitive to these flashing colors, uh, then just be careful watching the video. Um, but let's go ahead and continue. So as that whole auto updater thing, I made a couple of videos just sort of like my updates while I was making the game. We had a whole auto updater that would go to a uh, server that would take uh, current builds and then um, update them if they weren't. If your current build wasn't the same server, uh, ID number as the uh, clients. So that was a really cool thing, but now I don't actually even have that server, so we get an error when we start it up, but uh, no big deal. I also had sounds in here. I don't know where they went. Uh, I'm still playing this through the actual IDE of Eclipse, so some things can, you know, get mixed around. Um, so here we got a cool menu going on here. So we have play, my character achievements help credit, uh, achievements, yep, didn't add achievements in there. Uh, but if we go to help, we can learn more about the game. Power up, store, game modes. So you can read about it. Classic game of wave but with an insane amount of difficulty. We have, so we have a couple of different modes too, but rather than just wave one here. We have speed trials, survive with a huge amount of enemies flying in from all directions. We have dual mode. See if you can out survive a computer, AI that is in the game with you, and then Seizure Mode, a classic game of wave, but with uh, lots of colors heading directly towards your eyes, play with caution. <laughs> and then we have, you know, the whole story details, the power-up details, all of that stuff. So if we go to my character, we have a whole selection screen for my character, so I can change the name, so let's change it to Zach. And here we have statistics. Now, uh, because these save and load, these are all statistics that I had way beforehand, so I didn't. I haven't really played any of this before, but I guess we're level eight. Total distance travel. I don't think I put that in there. XP. I don't think I put in there. But total points used 53. Total points earned 67. Name changed eight times. Total games played 15. Highest wave 27. Wave survived 67. So that's pretty cool. That was a cool idea. If you go to customize, because based on your level, these were actually locked. So. But because I'm level 8, I have these all unlocked, these different skins that you can get for your character, which is pretty cool. So you can do, just do like a solid color, or we can do like the creeper. We'll do the creeper, because that's pretty cool. And we'll go back, and uh, we've got a whole credits thing that reads from a file that I was really proud about, whatever, it doesn't matter. Uh, so let's just play a classic game here. Let's go ahead and start it up. begin so again a lot like uh, wave one you know we've got a little bit of different placement on the heads-up display that was kind of a real challenge for me was how to uh, set up the heads-up display in these games because you don't want anything blocking it you know so all right we got the first guy here it's pretty simple so far and I know the store is actually a little bit better as well all right we got two now and we go to the store we have take less damage, increase total speed, score points faster, refill health, teleport power up, health regenerate, extra life, and deactivate enemies. Deactivate enemies is pretty cool. I'm going to do score points faster and um, increase speed. There we go. And... Obviously, a lot of you may notice that this is the game that was based off of my Java programming Let's Build a Game series. Oh, 
Oh no. Alright, we got three of them in there now. Come on. Very keyboard intensive game. Oh, the arrow keys do work, okay. So let's play with the WASD. Let's see. Alright, let's do health regenerate. Okay, cool. So it does work. We're regenerating some health slowly. And I guess you can upgrade that. Yeah, we're at level one. Ah! We've got the AI in here that our Let's Build a Game series is from. Oh my god, this is surprisingly difficult. Just the pattern that these guys are in. I'll slow my roll with my micro skills here. Regenerate. Or, uh... Or I could regenerate my health, or I could get a better. All right, now we're gonna refill my health. Oh man! Come on now! my health this is surprisingly difficult I do not remember this. Refill health. All right, come on now. Give me what you got. So there's more structure to the actual level design in this game, which I think is really cool. Oh, okay. All right, we got a little fit the fit the hole in the wall there. Regenerate health. We're doing it more. It's pretty easy now. Uh oh. Uh oh. Come on now. Here we go. Here we go. Whoa, ho, ho, yo, whoa, where's my deactivate, how do I, wait, how do I, store not available, what, wait, how do I use it, I forgot how to use it, I'm hitting D, I died. No. I right, well, that's a pretty good run. Let's go back. 
Um, let's see, insane mode, I guess it's just the same thing. Let's try our speed trials, because that looks cool. So here I think, all right, we got spawn rate, oh. All right, so this is a little bit different, I guess. We're just gonna stay in this sort of area here, and I would guess the spawn rate just increases the amount of these things spawn. So when it gets down to, okay, so like 10, it'll be really a lot. Oh, and I can't access the store either. It's really weird, why couldn't I, why couldn't I access my deactivate? I gotta look in the code to see what button it is. Or maybe in the help it'll tell me. Alright, so we're at 40. There's really no way to dodge these things though, I mean they come in so quick. There we go, come on now. Now we got a rhythm. No, no, that did not work at all. All right, let's try um, dual mode, which I guess would just be the same, except now we have this guy here, this computer, that is dodging these things as well. Got hit. Uh oh, so did I. We're playing against this computer. See how well he does. I don't know how I programmed this guy before. He's actually got some cognitive skills or. He's just randomly running around the room. I think it might be a mixture of both. Come on now. You know, he's not doing bad though. I think I'm doing worse. Let me figure out how you do this. All right, where's teleport? Oh, you know what? It's one and two, that's what it is. I'll be damned. That could have saved my life. try to deactivate enemies with one. Whoa, alright, that was not for a long time at all. What's even the point there? Oh, I died! No! <laughs> I was messing around with the power-ups. Alright, let's play... Alright, we're gonna play seizure mode just because I want to just try it. So, again, if you guys are sensitive to it, don't watch this part of the video. All right. Okay. Oh wow. Yeah, that is pretty. That is pretty bright. I can't even see the enemy. Oh man. Who plays this? <laughs> I guess I did. Where's the enemy? I can't. I just see like a faint trail. Oh my god, alright, my eyes are watering, I can't deal with that anymore, I <laughs> just exit out of the game. <laughs> oh man. Alright, well that's going to be wave 2, so go like, go and subscribe, thank you guys for watching, uh, I've got a, some more cool games of mine that I'll be showing you guys in the future, and as always, peace.